My partner Anastasia is a very hardworking farmer. She takes care of all of our animals, the ducks, chickens, turkeys, geese, guinea fowl, guardian dogs, sheep, and of course Mina, our milk cow. Mina is pregnant right now and she's due in mid-April. I thought I should do something to make her life a little bit easier. Uh, at first I thought I should build something, you know, because I'm a digital fabrication instructor and um, DFAB is a really cool program where students learn to design and make products from a variety of materials and tools. And as an instructor, I often experiment with new design ideas. And I'm particularly really interested in using 3D printing technologies of all sorts. Um, but before building something, I thought maybe I should check my local hardware store and see what they have available. I heard that they have some pretty cool sales on the Red Tools this Easter Monday. Besides being great at taking care of animals, Anastasia is also very handy with tools. She really likes the red tools, and over the years, we have collected a number of them and have a lot of batteries. Because we are off-grid and using solar power, having reliable battery tools is essential. Anastasia practices regenerative agriculture, and as part of that, uh, she constantly rotating the animals on pasture. Every day during the warm season, she would be milking Mina somewhere different on the field, which means there is no power available. And milking by hand works well, and she's really good at it. But sometimes you just get really tired of it, or if it's really cold, or you have other uh, things happening at the farm, yeah, you would like to take a break. It's nice to have some tool that can help with the job. With that in mind, I went shopping for the perfect red tool for Anastasia. It actually turned out to be quite a daunting task as I hit the stores. The shelves were full of red tools, and I looked them over and over, but none of them seemed really suitable or something that we didn't already have but then as i was just about to give up at the end of the aisle i saw the perfect tool sitting right there in front of my eyes i couldn't believe it it took a lot of searching but i'm glad i came out today and i went shopping because i found the original red tool milking machine it also acts as a flashlight uh, this is gonna be amazing. I think Anastasia will be really happy with this. It's gonna make her life so much easier. I can't wait to show it to her. I'm heading home right now. Okay, I better go get her. I can't wait to see what she thinks about this. I'll be right back. Is this yours? Wow! Happy, happy Easter. Wow! <laughs> Very nice. Try it out. Yes, I will. Huh, can I drop it? Whoa! It's so quiet. Right? I wonder how Wait. long it'll run on the battery. Wait for you. What if I drop it? <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's so light. I can like <laughs> carry it around anywhere. Yeah. Very nice. You still got your milk bucket? Yes, down okay. at the chute. Yeah. Awesome. Well, we have to uh, wait until, when is Mina due? April 17th. For 17, so. 17 days from tomorrow. Okay. I am really impressed with the quality of this machine. The rubberized base makes it durable for field use and the noise cancelling technology makes it for a much more peaceful milking session, especially for those early mornings. The ergonomic grip and the battery receiver are slick and fun to use and with the high quality PTG and TPU plastics, it sure feels like a premium product. So stay tuned if you uh, want to see it in action, uh, make sure to subscribe and share this video with somebody you think can actually use this. If anybody is milking in pasture and could use this. <laughs> it even has a flashlight for early morning and late night milking. <laughs> now this is awesome. Sweet. This is great. <laughs> Two thumbs up!